everybody welcome to the video and today we got the call of duty modern warfare 3 slash warzone season one reloaded overview just checking out what's dropping on season one reloaded so we're going to check out everything here of course there's going to be new weapons new maps new bundles and so forth and there's going to be a new 6v6 multiplayer map rio all right deploy to rio a new core map that challenges operators to street fight an upscale shopping center all right, we're going to get team gunfight for modes, infected, and headquarters. I personally am waiting for demolition, so hopefully season two comes in with demolition. We also have the boys LTM, which I think is going to be on multi on the multiplayer side, which I said that in a previous update video for Modern Warfare 3 and Warzone. And I think, yeah, it's not going to be in Warzone, it's going to be in Modern Warfare 3 multiplayer. And there's going to be a challenge of a ranked play is going to be live as well. Here's the brand new map, guys. New 66 map, Rio. All right. Deployed to upscale shopping center in Rio de Janeiro in a new medium-sized 66 multiplayer map featuring Central Indoor Mall, surrounded by Main Street, a tram station, a market, plaza, and cafe. All right. So it looks pretty good so far. I mean, the layout's a pretty big map. Uh, maybe 10v10 might be pretty good for this map. I don't know why the map's so big, but I mean, it seems that it seems that way at least. Uh, but there is going to be a left side, middle, and right, which I think that's the three lanes, which I think that's the best way to do that. Uh, we have new modes. We're getting team gunfight, headquarters infected. I think the team gunfight, we've seen that before in previous iterations or different versions of it in the past CODs, right? Especially with Modern Warfare, I think, 2, maybe even Modern Warfare 2019. I mean, heck, even Gold War, so different versions of that headquarters we know headquarters already which i think it's awesome that they're bringing it back finally infected we know infected as well uh we have the boys ltm and, it, and challenges of course we have new bundles coming in with the boys we got the boys soup siege okay prove that you belong in the soups by completing six challenges in the boys soup siege event challenge the challenge are at, as follows. So the, let's just not worry about the challenge itself, but more of the reward. Uh, we get the reward an emblem. We get a calling card, a battle pass tier skip, large decal, weapon charm, and a double XP token. And yeah, large decal again. All right, not too bad. And lastly, we do get the mastery reward of the boys special LMG weapon blueprint featuring the attachments equipped with the whopping 150 round round mag. Okay. Okay, so you just get a, a little bundle, or sorry, a blueprint at the end as well. And of course, we're going to get ranked play for, for the people who jump into ranked play. And go a little crazy, a little try hardy as always. Jump in, it's 4v4 matches. Not bad at all. Got the Call of Duty, CDL, Call of Duty League, right, stuff. And we're also going to get the, I believe the different skins. that I, I think that just came out today, I believe so. Might be wrong about that, but we have the skill division rewards and so forth. Zombie side of things, we have taken our new warlord, which is one of the new characters, or sorry, operators that showed up. New warlord enters the exclusion zone in the form of South Korean born Dukabe. Okay. Oh, yeah, Dukabe. Dukabe? Um, yes, it was the operator that's in the battle pass, but she's like the boss. Uh, defeat her if you can to earn high tier loot. As you can see, this is the look of her right here. And yeah, she's the warlord. She's, I guess, the boss, mini boss, and she's going to be on the map. You jump in and you take her down uh, and you get some high tier loot for taking her down we have the warzone overview warzone stuff we have the champion i think the champion's quest achievement champion's domination by completing a brand new quest for Zikstan. okay the gulag night vision public event that's a brand new one huh gulag night vision one battle in the dark using night vision oh wow so they're bringing back the night vision goggles wow just for the for the gulag though only for the gulag very interesting. Grab the weapon case. A new weapon case objective is available for the first time in Battle Royale. Players can now battle over a single weapon case hidden in a search area. Okay. That's, that's, uh, there you go. That's another little um, objective to complete during the Battle Royale. A new way to escape. Players can now exfil the match early with the help of Covert Exfil, offering a new condition for those able to pay the price for the ride out. Uh, okay. Uh, so there you go. It's a new way to escape that. Uh, take a chance on the quest in Urzakhan Champions Domination. Um, okay, so yeah, the infamous Champions Quest makes a debut in Urzakhan, challenging players with tiny new high-level tasks that will test all your squad's collective skills. And attempt to witness an extremely explosive finale. Hmm. Win thirty games. 
within the season or five consecutive matches. What the heck? All right. Well, that's pretty crazy. There's the NVG, Night Vision Goggles, Gulag Public Event. Here's the weapon case that will pop up. Okay. Not bad. Secondary win condition, Covert Exfil. Huh. All right. Speaking of Covert Exfil, players can now Exfil the match early with the help of Covert Exfil. Hmm. My session before the Gulag closes, it Covert Exfil calls in a helicopter that can fly any player out of the match, ideally with the weapon case in their possession. Hmm. That right there is going to be a tough task for sure. This can also complete, uh, compete to earn the most successful Covert Exfils with the new Covert Exfil leaderboard set. Wow. Brand new, eh? General overview, two new weapons. Ooh, we have new weapons, guys. The HRM9 SMG, you can see right here. All right, I don't know if this is, I don't, I don't know if this is a comeback of an old SMG, but it looks good. I mean, it's an SMG. I love SMGs. I usually rock SMGs, ARs, or, or shotguns. So I'm definitely down for an SMG, a new SMG. Uh, we have the TAC Evolver, which is an LMG, okay. Kind of like the Elsa battle. I love that drum mag. The drum mag looks pretty cool. All right. So we have that. New store offerings. We have A-Train. Of course, the boys. And Firecracker, which personally I'm excited for. Tracer Pack, the boys, Mr. A-Train. The A-Train himself is here. He'll be dropping by or dropping. And let's see what stuff he comes with. All right. So, and of course, we're going to check these out and showcase and cover the bundles when they drop. Uh, during the season when reloaded um, But it does come with the blue weapon blueprints featuring the tracers of turbocharged also AR and the fast AF <laughs> SMG nice tempting for sure though tempting for sure, but and, and the rest of the stuff But again, we're gonna cover it when the full bundle drops But guys definitely I think the boys firecracker operator bundle is gonna be for me maybe um, And I did kind of see this already little spoilers for me but it will come with featuring the Tracers, the Smoking Gun AR, and the Fellow Patriot LMG. An AR and an LMG blueprint, I'm down for that. I would, I mean, I, I would prefer an SMG, kind of like with the A-Train one. But, uh, I mean, I, I don't, it's a new character. She's going to be a new character in, or a new soup, right, in the boys, and she looks pretty badass. And hopefully, she turns out to be a good character. I mean, a lot of people are just judging her off the trailer, which is just a trailer, and... Who knows? Who knows what she'll be doing? What part? What part will she'll play in joining the seven? Right. Uh, so we'll see. We'll see what happens there. But right now, guys, this is just the coverage and look at what she'll be coming with in the bundle for Call of Duty and Warzone, of course. And yeah, so she has a weapon charm and stuff like that. All right. And uh, out of the combat overview, pretty much the CDL Intel drop, and at the end is the stuff I was telling you about, the Call of Duty Team Packs, which I think they dropped today. If not today, then they dropped, they're going to drop with Season 1 Reloaded. And uh, yeah, guys, that is going to be it for the video. If you guys did enjoy, press like, guys, I like us, we appreciate it. Thank you guys for watching, thank you guys for checking this out, and uh, checking the update here. Yeah, it's going to be a future update here, next. I believe next week, that is when the update goes live. So I'm very excited to check out all the new stuff that's dropping, especially the new map, for sure, get you guys gameplay. Um, and of course, the soups, or sorry, the boys LTM. And also event challenge, right? Or weekly challenge, whatever. It looks it looks cool. I uh, can't wait for that one. Can't wait for the mo uh, sorry, the abilities because the abilities we did get to check out in Warzone in Modern Warfare 2. But this time around it's gonna be multiplayer, so they'll be definitely more interesting to see how that goes. And uh, yeah, that's it guys for the video. If you guys did enjoy again, I like us always appreciate it. Thank you guys for watching. Take care guys, stay amazing. I'll see y'all with the next one.